In today's video, we're going to demonstrate how to swab your cat's ear. The supplies you need include Q-tips, they can be any kind of Q-tip you find at the store, a Ziploc bag, and a permanent marker. We're going to start by taking our Q-tip. Ours looks a little bit different than what you're going to find at the store, but that is fine. Whatever you have at your house will work perfectly. Next, Dr. Molitor is going to gently open up Junior's ear to expose his ear canal. I'm going to take that Q-tip and gently rub it back and forth in the ear canal. Make sure you never lose sight of the tip of the Q-tip. We're again going to demonstrate on Junior's other ear. Dr. Molitor is again opening the ear very gently to expose that ear canal. And again, we're going to take that Q-tip and gently rub it back and forth. Always have that Q-tip visible and that's how you ensure you're not going too deep into the ear canal. Once you've collected your sample, you're going to go ahead and put it in the plastic bag labeled with your pet's name, your first and last name, and the best phone number to reach you at. We should only need one Q-tip to test. Finally, you're going to drop your sample off at the sample collection bin outside the clinic's main entrance, and you're going to go ahead and give us a call to let us know that sample is in there. Make sure that you drop it off within 24 hours of collecting, and that you keep it refrigerated in between collecting the sample and dropping it at the clinic.